it's Etika from the Etika World Network here. Xenoblade Chronicles X recently did come out in Japan, so of course the news is flooding in. But one of the most controversial topics that's on everyone's minds right now is the outfits. Now, this won't hurt nobody in normal sense. You know, Japanese culture, when it comes to video games that are based on anime characters and lifestyles and whatnot, they do tend to be a little bit sexualized in some form or fashion. Now, I don't want to get too much into spoilers, but when I was chilling in the Fire Emblem, I mean, excuse me, not Fire Emblem, when I was chilling in the Xenoblade Chronicles X um, streams uh, when the game was released in Japan, I saw that there were some outfits available early on in the game that put the female characters in some pretty skimpy clothing, but then again, they also do so for the males as well too. Their swimsuit clothing. And it could be seen as kind of risque, but I guess that's part of the appeal of the game, I suppose. And I know that's probably a big influence from Japanese culture, too, to have something like that available right away. But then again, you know, I mean, American culture is pretty damn sexualized, too. Let's not even lie. But anyways, there's a very controversial topic that's on everyone's minds right now. It involves the character Lin Lee from Xenoblade Chronicles X. And I didn't know at one point what the age of Lin Lee was, but it's confirmed on the Japanese website and whatnot that she's 13 years old. So she's a 13 year old girl in Fire, I mean, excuse me, why do I keep saying Fire <laughs> um, Xenoblade Chronicles X. But the issue comes in where you can give her the swimsuits that are made for the adult or rather more adult characters or older characters that are female in the game. And it's a little controversial because she's 13 years old and wearing, you know, skimpy swimsuits. At the end of the day, they are swimsuits and it's not like any sexual activity is engaged with her, but still, it has some people a little bit on the edge of their seats. And this is one of the outfits, for example, that she can wear being 13 years old. And in Japan, things are a little bit different with the culture. Their age of consent, I suppose, is a lot earlier and younger than us over here in the United States. So I mean, it is a difference in culture. Most likely this is not going to make it over to the American version of the game. In some form or fashion, this outfit is most likely going to be disabled for Lin Lee. But still, let's see what the article itself has to say about this. This will be linked in the description below. So let's take a look. Um, following yesterday's release of Xenoblade Chronicles X in Japan, players took to the Miiverse to share their experiences with Monolith Soft's massive RPG on Wii U. Screenshots posted to the Xenoblade Chronicles X community show vast landscapes, high-tech combat, monsters galore, and, well, an obvious lack of clothing in so many ways. But, you know, I mean, I feel like this is one controversial issue that I hope doesn't hurt the overall experience of the game. Because if you watch this game on the streams, if you've seen the pictures, if you watch the directs, you know how amazingly massive this beautiful world is. I hope something like this doesn't hurt the game in any negative way when it's brought over to the United States and other territories in the world. Zen X allows players to customize the equipment and gear for all the characters in their party. And the options include everything from bulky armor to barely decent strips of fabric. Miiverse hasn't been shy about posting images of near nude party members on Nintendo's social network either, which is crazy. I mean, I, I find it hilarious. But then again, this game is not really made for kids. It's not aimed at kids, which is something that's unique for Nintendo. And it puts them in a little bit of an opposition position because now they have a game which is aimed at more mature audiences. So stuff like this wouldn't even be a surprise for, you know, I mean, people who were on like Sony or whatnot, but Nintendo has a very child-built fan base. So I mean, where do they stand with this? Um, okay, Miiverse hasn't been shy, blah, blah, blah. Lao's bare muscular pectorals are on full display as the 31-year-old guns down alien beast with his teammates. And like I said, this is shared. It's not like only the girls are getting this kind of treatment in terms of skimpy outfits. The men get it quite a plenty as well too. 28-year-old Elma shreds her sturdy spacesuit, leaving little to the imagination. Lin Lee at age 13 strips down to a tight bikini which shows off her cleavage. Yes, you read that right. And I'm not trying to sexualize the young teenager out of context either. Same here. Me neither. Many of the images of Lin Lee show the child wearing articles far more revealing than your average bikini. The Japanese players on Miiverse don't seem to really notice or mind that the game depicts a young child in a state of undress. Like I said, that's because ages of consent and whatnot are a lot younger in Japan. Japanese attitudes and sexuality differ from that of Western societies, and children as young as 13 can be legally consented to sexual activity in much of Japan, which is, oh my fucking, <laughs> fucking, I mean, I mean, I love Japan in a lot of ways, but holy shit. Um, that may explain why Xenoblade Chronicles X lets players dress up a child as if though she were an adult. Lin Lee, who's clearly said to be 13 on the game's website, is the youngest of many female characters that exist in the game, and the developers of Zen X have admitted that sexiness was a factor in character design, especially for women, which is pretty damn obvious. Lin Lee may not end up so young in the Western localization. Of course, Nintendo of America could opt to change her age to 18 and avoid any questions, or they could just keep her in her age and cover her up instead. 
We've included some images below, all taken from the Miiverse, of the outfits players can equip with 13 year old Lin Lee in. Whether this is an acceptable decision by the developers to create intriguing characters, or an inexcusable lack of morality on their part is for you to decide. So I mean, the main thing I think they're going to do, the easiest thing for them to do, especially since I know Monolith Soft probably has their hands busy on translation right now, change your age. Change your age. Before we had any confirmation, or at least before I found out any confirmation of her being 13 years old, I thought she was 18. I mean, being quite honest with you, I mean, my, like my girlfriend looks really young, but she's 22, you know what I mean? So I felt like, you know, everyone was saying to me, yo, Etika, blah, blah, blah. Um, Lindley, she's she. This looks mad young, doesn't she? And I was like, well, yeah, she looks young, but I mean, there's plenty of girls that look young out there. I'm dating a petite girl that looks very young myself too, but she's 22. Um, I thought Lindley was 18. She's not 18, but you know, consider. I mean, and this is not. I'm not trying to say this out of context at all, or to oversexualize the situation when I see when I make this statement. I know I make a lot of sexual innuendo jokes on my channel, but this is not one of them. Judging by the size of her cleavage, I thought that she was. 18 that's what I thought so I mean 17 18 whatever the case may be I thought that was the case so I mean they will most likely change her age up because I didn't think that it would be something that Japan would do I mean or Monolith Soft would do to give Lin Lee access to those bathing suits and being 13 it just doesn't sit right on the tongue Nintendo may just decide to keep her age but I feel like they'll probably change it at the end of the day because that just seems like the easiest solution change her age blah 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 the game is T for teen her age will be changed and they, they no longer have to say anything. Oh, she looks young, but she's 18. You know what I mean? And some, some of these outfits, are get, they get pretty goddamn like in there. I mean, like some of them are like, whoa, like 13 years old, like holy shit. <laughs> Where did Japan think this was okay? Um, and why give a 13 year old such a suggestive body in the first place? I mean, it just doesn't make any sense on all kinds of regards, but I mean, this is what we're dealing with right now. And uh, yeah, I can understand why a lot of people are sour about this. What is your opinion? And what do you think Nintendo's course of action is going to be? Some people, let's see what their opinions are. Ray says, oh no, a character is... Wait, okay Ray, you gotta work on your grammar. Um, oh no, a character has one costume where they sew cleavage. I guess she can't possibly be a good and well-developed character at all because she has boobs. God forbid a woman has boobs, grow up. Yeah, she's a bit young and in Western culture this is unaccepted. But when do we stop pointing the finger at her breasts and start looking at her character? I haven't heard a damn thing on her story arc. It's a different country, different culture in Japan. Get over it. He has some good points. Some points I don't agree with, but I mean, still, it's a strong opinion. And I mean, yeah, I don't think that we should look at this as her personality or her character development being taken away from it. Once again, you have to understand that we do not have this translated. So a lot of English Americans, um, not English Americans, but you know, a lot of Americans, a lot of Europeans will look at the game see the dialogue, not know what's going on, and then see her in a swimsuit and be like, what the fuck, she's over-sexualized. You don't really know what her personality is too much. There's translations and whatnot, but they could totally change that by the time she comes over to Western audiences. So I don't think we should judge this too early because she is not conformed for American society right now. Things might be a little misconstrued by communication of how she may come across, you know what I mean? Um, Ziff says, this is not really newsworthy, in my honest opinion. It's Japan, people. It's the norm there. Do you know Senan Gakia? A game full of underage students showing their skin every chance they get. Not to mention the franchise came over to the West, but everyone turns a blind eye. Good point. The only reason why this is getting highlight is because it's Nintendo. Like I said, they have a younger demographic with a mature game coming out. People are going to be like, what? What? Hold up. Skirt. <laughs> um, like Ray said, we have different cultures, so let's get over it. This kind of stuff is too old already. To be fair, Monolith lets players customize their characters, so it's ultimately the player's choice if they want to give skimpy outfits to his or her party members. That's a strong point. I mean, either way, I want to see what you guys have to say about this. What do you think Nintendo's course of action will be? Will they censor it? Will they change her age? Or will they do something else that you think is totally out of nowhere, left field and whatnot? Let me know in the comments below. I feel like they'll just change your age, but that may not be the most practical solution. They might go out of their way to make sure that no one ever sees this young looking girl in a bikini swimsuit like this ever, you know? I mean, if they could censor Tharja from Smash Brothers, and Tharja is of age, of course, with a body like that, she's definitely of age. And, you know, so I mean, hey, I don't know. Either way, I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Take care of yourselves, leave your opinions, and have yourself a damn good one.